Hey friends, uh, I hope you, your family and your pets are all doing well. Things are not uh, how they're supposed to be out there and I really hope you're following the protocols. Um, I'm going to make this video super short because this was actually uh, supposed to be a part of my next proper video. But since there's a lot of confusion out there and my uh, very dear friend Jatin actually went ahead to take all the effort and make a meme video out of this uh, so I thought like let's uh, give proper uh, respect to the topic and address this uh, on an individual video so uh, the thing I'm not going to talk about is uh, in my last video where I showed how to prepare a quick uh, homemade food for your fishes uh, I had used goat heart uh, that's why it's goat heart mix or GHM uh, along with a lot of other ingredients and but previously in uh, one of my uh, videos I had talked about uh, not uh, feeding your fishes uh, with um, uh, you know uh, animal mammalian meat or uh, uh, avian meat where like I was talking about chickens, goat, mutton, whatever not to feed your fishes those meat uh, so Jatin uh, as he had made that video like he had actually compiled both of them so I'm gonna quickly show you that and then uh, tell you why uh, I have shown where and what. So here we go. the dancing Paul Bearers by the way so like I love the music Astronomia Astronomia I guess yeah so um, uh, uh, and I had a lot of comments uh, in my last video as well where people were actually confused where why did I actually go ahead and uh, showed uh, uh, goat heart like uh, you're not supposed to feed uh, mammal in meat well I'll still say please 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 do not feed your fishes animal meat now when I say meat it's usually uh, you know the f uh, muscles the, uh, the flesh that we buy in the market so when you go ahead and ask for you know a certain amount of chicken or certain amount of uh, mutton they give you the fleshy part along with the fat I didn't actually want to go into the detailed scientific uh, explanation because it just makes things a lot more harder uh, I, I would prefer things to be a lot simpler uh, and easier to understand for everyone but since there is this question I think I have to uh, explain this scientifically so a uh, body has three types of uh, muscle fibers uh, skeletal muscles cardiac muscles and smooth muscles uh, skeletal muscles as I say are the muscles which are joined to the bones you know the muscles we use for fingers. Uh, smooth muscles are the uh, tissue which lines uh, in the esophagus like the foot, uh, foot pipe, uh, intestines, uh, usually involuntary muscles which you cannot control but still moves. Uh, those are uh, made of uh, smooth muscles, I'm sorry. Now cardiac muscles as the name suggests uh, is what the heart is made of and only the heart is uh, made of cardiac muscles, no other organ. Muscles which we usually consume or tend to feed our fishes are skeletal muscles, you can leg pieces, press, whatever. Those muscles have uh, quite a good portion of IMGTs or IMGCLs which are intramuscular triglycerides or intramuscular fat in, uh, to be short 
Now these are flat, uh, I'm sorry, fat globules present in within the muscle fibers. Cardiac muscles do not have those fat. The reason why we ask fish, uh, you not to feed your fishes with animal meat is because uh, animal fat has a high melting point. Fishes cannot digest that particular fat, which results in them getting sick. It's easier or safer to use cardiac muscles because A, it does not have fat in them at all. Because if the heart has fat, that's a bad heart. And uh, B, uh, the recipe that I use, showed uh, actually distributed that part. Uh, that uh, I used 150 grams of heart. And after uh, taking out the fat and the arteries and the veins, it was about 100 grams, I guess. So that 100 gram of meat was being distributed throughout the entire food that I had made. And if you had gone through the video properly, uh, it was in small cubes and like there were a lot of cubes. And that's going to feed me for the uh, entire month. So we are talking about 100 grams of heart for the entire month. The so dosage is like minimum because it's also added uh, to uh, uh, prawns, uh, fishes. I had used uh, carplets, uh, Indian carplets, so uh, morula, so Indian carplets, veggies, and like egg yolks, and whatever. So, yeah, so there are two things why we can use goat heart or chicken heart or beef or pork hearts. A, the muscles that are present in the heart do not contain fat. B, it's in a very small percentage. Uh, I actually didn't want to go into the details because, you know, it's just a wastage of time. I still say no meat, but heart, yes. Uh, I hope this was clear enough for you. Uh, uh, but please uh, get back to me in the comment section or uh, <laughs> ring me up, uh, ping me up. Uh, uh, with your confusion and I, I'm, I'm so glad that you guys actually go ahead and watch all my videos like I do get a graph from YouTube about this but then again you re remember what I had told about like a couple of videos back and then you're comparing with the last one that I had uh, I, in no way this was offensive for me but I'm actually overwhelmed that uh, you guys do take notice of what I'm saying I, I'm, I'm super stoked and I'm so happy that I have you guys as my audience. That's it. Not gonna waste any more of your time. I really hope that this helped you a lot, uh, clearing out the confusions that you had. And I wish all the best for you to keep your pets stay uh, safe, uh, keep them healthy. And uh, I'll meet you guys soon with a proper video.